Hey. hey guys, uh, Crew Todd Wetter here, uh, Chief Instructor and Owner Operator at Cage Dragon Mixed Martial Arts. Uh, currently, um, Cage Dragon has been open for approximately eight years. Um, we compete in amateur Muay Thai, boxing, and Jiu Jitsu. Oh, where's your counter? Where's your counter? Counter back! Me, I got myself in uh, my start in martial arts being a 240 pound fat, out of shape fan of MMA. Um, after I started training with Sean Tompkins in London, uh, I, my passion grew, I started to lose weight, and that's when my competitive spirit began to build. Uh, shortly after that, I competed in my first Muay Thai fight, fell in love, and continued to have some fights in Muay Thai and some fights in boxing, with my last fight being in 2011, where I won a Canadian Muay Thai Championship in New Brunswick. Decided I had had enough of traveling outside of my own city to uh, to train. So approximately eight years ago, I decided I was gonna open Cage Dragon here in Brantford. Um, I've grown a very stable, uh, very productive and um, uh, skilled group of fighters. Um, currently, we have two champions at the gym in Muay Thai. Um, myself being a Canadian uh, WAMTAC Muay Thai champion at 165 pounds. And my main stud here at the gym, Alex Rosicki, who's competed in over 40 amateur and pro-am Muay Thai fights and um, currently holds five different titles um, in Muay Thai with many more titles to come, hopefully. It was a great experience. You know, it meant a lot for the gym. Uh, shortly after that, I received my crew status, uh, crew meaning uh, certified teacher of Muay Thai uh, through a John Card Con Fady of Fady's Muay Thai in Cambridge. And uh, since then, you know, I've really seen the growth of the Muay Thai community here in Brantford and in the gym. Uh, we've grown a very successful youth Muay Thai program, Little Dragons program. I have kids as young as nine years old competing in sanctioned fights. Um, and those kids are the future of the gym. So. Step, step, step. And then on that third step, we're lifting and pushing. Uh, okay, you guys ready? One more round? Okay, let's do it. Fight. Show me combination. There it is. Oh, keep that head up, boy. Knee to the face, all done for the day. You know, when I first started training in martial arts, I never really thought that it would be possible for myself to own a gym like this or even uh, a greater accomplishment to be able to be the courier, the chief instructor here at the gym. Um, you know, I, I, I chase my dreams and I worked really hard and I've, I've become very successful at it. You know, so if a person like myself, who really had no background in martial arts at all, no schooling for business, you know, nothing like that, if I can make it work for myself, then, you know, you gotta go out there, you have to chase your dreams and you have to make it happen for yourself. You have to realize that nothing good comes easy, so keep your mind at it, you know, keep working hard and just push yourself to, to be the best you can and strive for your goals, that's all I can say.